Hi Gemini, Mary here. I have your monthly guidance for the month of December 2018. And I just want to thank you for your likes, your subscribes, and your shares. I really appreciate it. And just know it's a general reading. It's not going to resonate with everyone. Uh, take what resonates and leave the rest. You can always go to my website, thelighthousemedium.com, if you would like a private reading. Ooh, it's hot. <laughs> this is um, almost my last reading, and I've had the air conditioning off because it's pretty loud. So if I'm sweaty, sorry. <laughs> Okay. The first card up is the Ace of Cups. And that's followed by the Seven of Cups. And then we have the Five of Wands. Okay. Now, Aces are all about new beginnings. And Cup energy is usually like emotion, love, emotional stuff. So I feel like you have a new beginning um, emotionally, a new start um, on an emotional level. So this could be even new love coming into your life, but it doesn't have to necessarily be romantic. Um, I just feel like you're feeling really emotionally fulfilled this month. <clears throat> Excuse me. Now you have the Seven of Cups. The Seven of Cups is all about opportunity. So you have, you have opportunities coming this month as well, quite a few. Um, you see all the different energies, earth energy, air, water, fire. So you have a lot of opportunities coming. You may need to keep an open mind. Um, hmm. Things might not come exactly as you saw them coming. So you may have to keep an open mind. And in some situations, for some of you, not all of you, but for some of you, you may feel even a little bit overwhelmed by the uh, amount of opportunities that are coming your way. So just keep an open mind. You also have the Five of Wands. Now this is a conflict card. Um, there's people fighting, but there's no winners and there's no losers. You can see they're not really even touching each other. So I feel like um, this card is kind of a warning to stay out of any conflict, stay out of any gossip specifically. I'm getting gossip. Gossip is bad. It's just bad juju, judgment. Um, but I'm going to pull a clarifier card for this. I feel like there's conflict um, could be in the workplace, could be with family. I feel like it, this is a more of a, a career thing, a workplace thing. But either way, um, if you're in a conflict, a situation, try not to talk about other people behind their back, stay out of gossip. Stay out of conflict if you can, but if you have to speak your truth, you can do so with love and integrity. Um, when I pulled a clarifier for this, I have the Empress card. Okay, I know what this means. <laughs> Is it the Empress or the Emperor? Oh my God, glasses. It's the Emperor. All right, what I'm getting from this is you may be in some conflict because you like to be in control of the situation. Sometimes you like to be in control, right? You can't always be in control. You may have to give up some control here. You may have to step aside um, and let people make their own decisions or um, you may have to make a decision to be right or be happy. To be right or be at peace. Okay, so I'm going to pull a card from Colette Baron Reed's Wisdom of the Oracle. This is for the sign of Gemini for December. This card wanted to jump, so I'm taking it. Breathe. Take time to meditate. Take time to breathe. Step back from a situation. Don't, don't react. 
respond. Take time to breathe. When we breathe, um, three long, slow, deep breaths. That brings us to the center, into the present moment. And that, um, if you can find that space, that's going to help you. I mean, I struggle with it every day, believe me. Um, but I feel like, uh, especially when it comes to whatever conflict is coming up, you want to take a step back, take time to breathe. Don't, re don't react too quickly. And... Um, um, just respond. Archangel Sandalphon. Archangel Sandalphon works with our chakra that is about a foot below our the soles of our feet into the earth. So you can call on him if you want help with that. It's called our earth star chakra. But he brings our prayers to heaven. He's one of the archangels that was actually in human form at one time. And he is the twin brother of Archangel Metatron. Um, the card says, thank you Sandalphon for delivering delivering my prayers to heaven. So um, call an Archangel Sandalphon and um, know that he does bring your prayers to heaven. He does bring your prayers to Source Energy, God, whatever you want to call it. Um, and you can work with Archangel Sandalphon to... Um, it's interesting that you got this Breathe card and the Miracle of Prayer. Um, Prayer works. I've witnessed it myself. So if there's something that you are trying to accomplish in your life or that you need help with, call an Archangel Sandalphon. Pray about it. And then um, spend some time breathing and listening for the answer. Sometimes the answers don't come exactly as we want them. But they do come. Um, this is from Kyle Gray's angels and ancestors and it's the season of autumn it says release the old and rest I love that release the old and rest let it go release it and take some time out to breathe and rest okay Gemini I'm going to leave it there uh, if you do like these readings, please like, subscribe, and share. And I'd love a comment below if you resonate. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you have a wonderful holiday season and a great month of December. Take care.